Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Mike Witcher. Thanks for checking out your daily forecast. It's super easy and super simple to get the updated weather information that you want. And that's why this is East Tennessee weather. Weather when you want it. We've got some serious news to talk about, by the way. Uh, after a very mild start today, it's going to be warm. We're talking near record highs again today. We had several yesterday. It's going to be dry and even breezier than what we had yesterday. So therefore, our fire concerns are much more elevated uh, and we've got some burn bans in place. And then finally, we'll end the work week with some rain showers, but no drought busting rain. Let's get everybody out the door. Then I'll talk about the fire danger here in just a moment. But we start the morning off with temps in the 50s. Uh, we'll climb into the mid 70s by lunchtime. So a fantastic lunch hour to get out and enjoy. And our high temperatures today will make it into the upper 70s to low 80s. Now, with that said, the National Weather Service has issued a special weather statement. We're talking about an elevated fire risk. It's going to be breezy. We're talking low relative humidity. As I mentioned, there are burn bans around the area. We've got the ongoing extreme drought that continues to expand up the Southern Valley and will likely do so again tomorrow when the new one comes out from the U.S. Drought Monitor. So we've had the drought in place. We've got, uh, we haven't had any rainfall, so our soil moisture is extremely low and that creates very dry, tender vegetation. And with that said, we've already had the fires burning around East Tennessee. We've got the hazy conditions out there, the smoky conditions. We actually have an air quality alert over into North Carolina. Look at all the thick smoke over into North Carolina and the mountains over there. So again, we've already had the fires burning around town. The wind is gonna pick up throughout the day today. We're talking wind sustained anywhere from about 10 to 15 miles per hour, gusting to about 20 to 25. At times, you combine that with the low relative humidity, and that just elevates that fire danger even more so. And that's why the National Weather Service has issued that special weather statement. So watch out for those burn bans. Burning is not advised at this time. All right, so forecast highs, near record high temperatures. Many of us are likely to break some records throughout the day today. It's going to be a nice evening, though. We're going to see temps by 5 at 78, dropping down to 67 degrees by 9 o'clock here this evening. Rainfall amounts for our Friday and maybe uh, some rain on Sunday. So I'll keep you posted on that. The models are kind of flip-flopping right now. So I wouldn't cancel any outdoor plans this weekend. Uh, but it does look like the rain on Friday could bring us anywhere from a quarter to maybe upwards of half an inch of rain. And that does include our Sunday possibility for rain. So our three-day forecast after highs in the uh, upper 70s to low 80s today We'll be in the mid-70s tomorrow, increasing clouds, rain late tomorrow into and through the day on Friday. Because we'll have rain on Friday morning and for much of the day anyways, at least overcast gray skies, temperatures are going to struggle to get out of the 50s. We'll rebound back into the 60s both Saturday and also Sunday. Looking ahead towards the middle and latter part of the month, the Climate Prediction Center is actually predicting the possibility of above average temperatures and very dry conditions once again. This is an unprecedented fall for sure around uh, East Tennessee and much of the region. Actually, it's it continues to be the extremely dry where rainfall since September 1st, Chattanooga's only picked up 42 hundredths of an inch of rain. Knoxville's only picked up an inch, and this is since September 1st. And the Tri-Cities has only picked up just shy of two inches of rainfall, which puts us well behind even the second driest fall on record. Have a great day. Be safe. Be kind to each other. And thanks for checking out your daily forecast.